YouTube, I'm back again today for another Kickstarter critique where I take a look at a different Kickstarter project every time and give my honest thoughts on how that Kickstarter is being ran. And today I got a special Kick Booster one, which means if you click on the link down below, I actually get a small portion of whatever you back. Because today I'm very excited to be checking out the iSwift Pie Paper Thin Durable Laptop Desk for Bed and Office. That is a mouthful. It's in Gadgets and it is currently... Let's see. I always like to check, see how popular it is. The, ooh, there's more. The fourth most popular project on there. Unfolds in seconds, easy to store and carry, six transformations, improved posture for boosted. I like what they have here. I, I, I definitely see the appeal of this project, and I think mentioning six transformations is a great way to go. I'd love to see a price slapped on there as well. Don't beat around the bush. If this is, fi if this is $60, put $60 here. I don't even think twice about it. As always, when I go into this video, I'm thinking three things. Do I want it? Can you do it? How much is it? Hopefully this video will convince me of at least one of those things. A must-have for WFH. I don't know what that is. Introducing iSwift Pie, a paper-thin laptop table for working from home on oh, your yeah. bed, couch, or from the office. Fold oh. it into a table, it ensures you to work at the most comfortable posture, whether sitting or standing. Okay, and I love the fact that they are really showing in detail how this works and how you do it and how you fold it. Because I see too many Kickstarter projects where it's like these really quick little cute cut angles where it's like, shoot, and then it's like over here, and then it's like over there. And it's like, no, I just want to see you cut through the product. not. And, and so I like the fact that they're really getting, they're showing what we want to see. I think that's a great start. It is flat, lightweight, easy to store, oh. and transport. Oh, stop it. Wow. Its strong magnets enhance the stability of the whole structure. Excellent. Whichever mode it is, iSwift Pi will be reliable to boost your efficiency while removing mm. your back and eye strain during long work. Oh, stop. It firmly holds the weight of all kinds of devices up to 44. Wow. That's what I love to say. I will say I see it. I see it bowing just a little bit there. But that's a lot of stuff. That's what I wanted to see. That makes me feel good. Because I'm never going to have more than realistically 25 pounds on this thing. Um, so I'm loving this video. Pounds. Made of premium PU, iSwift Pi is water resistant and heat resistant and immune to all daily stains. Hmm. Nice. iSwift Pi invites you in a new era for working from home. Whether you are in bed, standing, or sitting on sofa, you could always find the coziest working posture. now okay okay very solid video i think that was an excellently done video do i want it is a resounding yes can you do it leaning toward yes normally you know i do need to go here and oh that's 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 always no no good uh but you showed me the prototype you showed me the working model and i actually got to see it being functional and that put my mind at ease uh, we're a team that focuses on designing products that are both versatile and convenient. First created, zero backed, always looks bad. A whole bunch of collaborators on here, but none of them are going to help you with your updates. Uh, which hopefully that means we got some good customer service because there's a lot of backers here. Two th we almost have 3,000 backers. So right now, do I want it? Yes. Can you do it? I'm still a little bit concerned. How much is it? Hopefully you hit me with the price right now. Ice with Pi Max out now. I don't know what that means. I'm assuming that's a larger version. Either way, a price would be great right here. Introducing iSwift Pi, a must-have laptop desk for God! Why do they always do it with the redundancy on these Kick Booster products? So what we're going to see here is we're going to see pretty much that great video regurgitated right down here, but with a little bit extra thrown in. Most of the time, that's how Kick Booster projects work. And it just it drives me nuts. Just hit me with a price already. Working in a bed or a couch... Looks useful. Oh, oh, here we go. This is a little bit different. Yes, uh, a review from a person. Yep. 31,000 subscribers, so I'm sure if I, if I, uh, a lot of people know this person, that's what I want to see. And this is him actually using it. Excellent. Right, and now you're limiting factor, I think. Fantastic, fantastic. That's exactly what I want to see. Just hit me with the price already. Hit me with the price. Extreme. I know it's versatile. I know your video impressed me. These are great. This is all good. More of the same. Good. Look at that. Okay, cool. You show me the dimensions. Spectacular. Let's go. Let's go with the price. Let's go with the price. Get me to the price. Get me to the price. Get me to the shipping. Come on. I, just, these kick booster products, they just they drive me mad. 
why they do this. Even here, they're not going to have the price. Hey, lap gear. Cooper Mega Table. You know what? And here's the other thing. If your price is better than their price, which I bet it might be, why don't you? Let's see. How much does a lap gear cost? Lap gear price. I don't even ugh, Lap gear price. $34. That is for the pro. The Cooper Mega Table. Let's see. Because I am interested now. I want to know how much the competition is. I feel like that's important to know. Cooper Mega Table, 70, 70 bucks. Okay. So 38 bucks, 70 bucks. What's your price? Oh, I don't know. Uh, this is cool. Great rewards. Here we go. Price, $69. So you are asking more than the Cooper Mega Table. The XXLR laptop, desk, for bed, and sofa. Okay. Perhaps don't compare yourself to them. I don't, I don't know if that's really the best play here. Because to be quite frank with you, I was unaware that there was more products that were like in this market. You know, I just kind of came in here and I was like excited, like, oh, this would be totally good for me. I wasn't aware of the lap gear, which is only $38 or the Cooper Mega Table. But now I kind of want to go look at the lap gear and look at some reviews of the lap gear. You have successfully introduced me, introduced me to your competition. And then when I researched your competition, I found out that you were in fact more expensive than them. And you are unproven, whereas I can go look at the reviews for the lap gear. Let's check this out. Let's check out this Cooper Mega lap gear. Let's see what kind of... Look at that. Four and a half stars with 54... Th wow. Wow. That's pretty solid. I, I kind of want a Cooper lap gear. Whoa. It's got little pull... It has a little thing that pulls out. Okay. See, see this is why you don't introduce us to... Young ah, it's like R. Kelly. He's Mr. Steel Young Girl. All right, he, he, don't introduce your competition to your bill. Oh, that's so bad. All right, so $69, you're more than them. $79 for the regular price, you're more than them. And these are for the re these are for the pie. This is the max is $89. Just I I I can't unsee what I've seen. And it's cool. You got add-ons, great. Upgrade to four. You know what you should do? How about you take this? this reward section and you just drag it all the way up to the top and then we take this section and we just drag it to the trash okay or maybe we cut off this like that's so bad so bad design draft what is this what the hell cool great awesome spending our work day in bed on the couch to become normal whatever bunch of stock image stuff <laughs> okay we're getting to the part of this Kickstarter that I'm really not a big fan of. All right, it's coming to March. Well, it's, okay, so you guys delayed. I might want to fix that. I might want to. Oh no, no, no! Maybe it launched in March. It's just been going. I bet that's what it is. I bet that's what it is. Test video. Here we go. This is what I want to see. Hopefully, this is talking. Nope. So, yeah, this is this is all I need. This is all I need. You can have that dude at the top. That review at the top. But you're giving me way too much information. So let's go over here. Let's check out the price levels. So we got $10 as a thank you. I hate this. Nobody wants this. Six people. Who took this? Who took this? What six people are like, you know what? I don't really need a lap desk right now. But I really appreciate you bringing your lap desk to Kickstarter. Here's 10 bucks. Who the hell is doing this? Like... Maybe maybe it's just for the add-ons or something, but then you, you don't even say it. Like, this will give you access to the add-ons and the pledge manager at the end. So who are these six people? Blows my mind. They must be friends of the creator, I'm guessing. I don't know. Get one Swift Pie at $69. And that's the other thing. You have not in any way, shape, or form made me believe, like, this is a good mom-and-pop Kickstarter story. I feel like I'm backing a Chinese company. That's exactly what I feel like. And that's not bad or good. It's just, I think you're a... I think a lot of people come to Kickstarter and they want to support people's dreams. And that is in no way, shape, or form what the Swift Pie feels like. Cool. $89. The Max. The Early Bird. I don't even care. Like, I can't unsee what I've seen. You know? So I always have to rank these a 0, 1, or a 2. 0 means don't waste your time. 1 means back it for a dollar, come back in the last 40 hours. And 2 means back it for the whale. And I'm not going to go with a zero on this one because I'm sure this one does things differently that the, their competition doesn't do. So let's go check that out. Like, they brought up their competition, which I still think is a terrible, terrible idea. But let's see what they're actually bragging about that they do differently. All right. Works in bed. This one does not have adjustability. Okay. This one does not have portability. Uh, okay. That's cool. 
The size is smaller, which would go with the portability. And adjust angles. Okay. So you're mentioning that you're more versatile than them. I don't know. I still just feel like it's a bad call bringing them up. But anywho. So what do we got? We got five people taking these ones, which is a good chunk of this. Okay, so we got the pledge levels. You know, I'm kind of off the rails here. I'm going to give it a one. If you are absolutely just gaga over the moon, you know what? I think I'm being this harsh on this one. I really do. Because can I can I take the Cooper Mega Table with me? How foldable is the Cooper Mega Table? That's what I need to know. Because if we're going for portability, like if that's your big pull here, I think you should have leaned into that a little bit more. And in fact, that was the one shot in the video that I did not see that I wanted to see was someone quickly taking this out of a backpack or taking it out of a suitcase or something like that. If you're trying to show, because this is, this is a great work thing. I could see myself taking this with me to places and doing work when I'm on the road. Uh, and yet you're more focused on the at home functionality of it. And I don't know if that's necessarily the play. Like maybe somebody's sitting in an airport. You know, they got this here. They got their coffee up there on the thing. You know, that, I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to give it a one, though. Let's check out the FAQ, the updates, the comments it's got here. What are the dimensions of the Swift Pilot? Whatever. You already talked about that. You talked. We listened. Bigger iSwift is out now. Hmm. Interesting. Who talked? So your first update was, was very bad. It was a flaming dumpster fire of epic proportions. Three hearts. Chances are you're one of them, too. That means whatever you posted was not engaging in any way, shape, or form. And then nobody commented on it. That's a terrible update. 1831, yes, a much better update. Let's see how it went. Now, the Icewood family has grown by over 2,500 backers. We were so overwhelmed by your support. There's no way we'd have made it this far if it wasn't for each and every one of you. So since we launched, many of you say that it would be better to make Icewood Pie bigger and have more color options. May I know if you consider making a longer version? I would be interested in a larger version. Uh, so these are people. We hear your voice. The pie, the pie max is out. Blah blah blah. Approve product improvement. One more angle. Oh, that's that's actually cool. Two new colors. Stretch goal. Okay, great. Give me the stretch goals. This is exciting. This is a great update. Whoever did your first update really dropped the ball. Luckily, second update looking good. I, I doubt you're gonna end with a question though. I think a question would have been great. I swift kickstand. Felt carrying space. These swift. I swift efters that make you. Uh, yeah, this great. That's a great shot. What is this? These iSwift extras that will make... What is what is this thing? What is that? When did... That's the iSwift kickstand. I want an iSwift kickstand. That's great. I'd put that on the Kickstarter page. Well, higher, once again. Higher. Don't make me sit through all that garbage twice. I mean, the garbage was great. Don't get me wrong. I just ate an all-you-can-eat buffet. I don't need another all-you-can-eat buffet in the story. Hit me with the price. Hit me with this iSwift kickstand. I want that. I want that right now. How could I add add-ons? Log into your account. Click. That's another thing. Is the dollar... Can I, ooh, this is, this is okay. Interesting. Um, comments. It may be worth mentioning that if you are adding add-ons to a Kickstarter pledge, then it often cannot be done via the Kickstarter app. My reward is for two stands, Can you? and you're not responding to them. I've been trying, but I can't change my pledge. It always takes me to a first confirmation. Uh, okay. There we go. So now they're responding, but they need to respond to these ones as well. Okay. Comments. What do we got? doesn't look like a flaming dumpster any updates on any wear and tear testing done so let me try this question again please okay so pu is polyurethane whether you call it pu or pu leather i think polyurethane leather is an artificial leather made of used for furniture i respect if they're so familiar why the upcharge i respectfully ask so they're asking why is the leather so expensive the raw material is a pu i don't i don't care i don't <laughs> okay i don't think most people do care wow they are so their, their customer service is good though i will say whoever's running this customer service is popping. So good on you. Good on you there. Uh, I'd end the next update with a question. Ask, you know, what, what could you possibly want more from this sort of thing? You know, we can't guarantee anything, but you know, we, we're, we're always trying to listen. Uh, that sort of thing. So in the end, I'll give it a one. I'm going to give it a one. I, I see, I see, I, you know what? Part of me is leaning towards a two now. Cause here's the thing functionality functionality is what I, functionality is what i was focused on not portability and portability is a whole different beast and so you know what i am leaning towards a two actually with the ice with pie i want one and, and that's what that's like my main thing i think they've convinced me and the extra ten dollars over the cooper whatever it is you know this cooper mega table well I, once again 
I'm probably not taking this, this with me on an airplane. Maybe not. This is more like a TV trade table. But still, you gave me second thoughts. You gave me second thoughts that I shouldn't have been there. Don't mention your competition. But I would lean a little bit more in how small you are and how portable this is. Because I think that is that is very appealing. But anywho, long-winded, loquacious, eye-swift, pie, paper-thin, durable last top desk for bed and office. I'm going to give it a two. I mean, yeah. I feel like the price is reasonable if we're going portable portability-wise. There's a review up of it. There's actual videos of people using it and utilizing it, despite the fact I am a little bit concerned about the fact that you have never done anything else before. Like, that... Now, I'm going to give it a one. I can't give it a two. That, that alone, I don't feel like we're, we're getting the whole story on iSwift. So let's, let's go Google iSwift. Because the fact that you just magically pulled another one out, like, oh yeah, we're doing an extra large one as well. I Swift. So there's no I Swift. There is I Swift Pi. So this is somebody else using the Kick Booster link. Yeah. So I Swift is is a ghost. Is that is it? Face. It's not even on Facebook. I Swift Facebook. That worries me. This concerns me. Oh oh. oh here we go. Is this it? Is this it? Huh? I Swift. Nope. This is not it. This is something else. Yeah, I'm going to give it a one. I'm going to give it a one on that one. I can't go two. Even though I do think the thing looks really stinking cool. That is the iSwift Pi Paper Thin Durable Desk Laptop for the Bed and Office. I would honestly give it a one and I'd say watch that one review video of that dude. See if what he's selling is what you're buying. And in that case, yeah, pull the trigger on it. It looks pretty stinking cool. Even though I am a little bit concerned about their track record. If you enjoy what I'm doing, please be sure to click on that subscribe button down below. As we're trying to reach 9,000 subscribers, celebrate my nine-year anniversary of making YouTube content. And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube. Bye-bye.